Happy 2018 everybody. Hope you had a good night. We did, we had a good time. Oh no, did I burn the toast? Oh, good start to the year, Grego. I'm making an omelette here. Because I've got nothing in the fridge to eat. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Put some cheese there. enough it's hard to do this with one hand I wanted it to flip more. I had to put this down. Damn you, camera. Yum. Yeah, um, uh. So we've come to barbecues galore today. Um, just because got nothing else to do. And uh, I have seven sacks said I should go and look at a twin Ziggy from here. That costs twice as much as the one from Bunnings. Now, <laughs> why I would want to get one that costs twice as much, I got no idea. But let's go inside and just take a look at the barbecues in here. So here's one, it's outside of Ziegler Brown. No, it hasn't got a hot plate, it's no good to me. You're dead to me. Look at this one. This one here, like weighs, oh, it's so heavy and solid. It's got coals in it. Man, the Camadoja. Now that's a barbecue. It'd want to be 1500 bucks, Jesus Christ. Whoa, barbecues galore has got everything here. It is literally barbecues galore. Oh, this one looks good. Looks like a pizza oven. Jeez, I think I broke it. Got a huge grill here. Damn. Here we go. A fire three hundred dollars for this one with a glass lid. Gee, that's all right. That's a nice looking barbecue. Ooh. Yep, 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 that's nice. Let's see what the most expensive barbecue is in this place. I mean, have a look. Ooh. There's like a plethora. There you go, 1500. Oh, that's nice. The heat's on. Oh, this one's on. Be careful. Be careful or I'll see you. Right, well, here's a two and a half thousand dollar barbecue. And have a look at this. It hasn't got a hot plate, but it's got like these electrical. Are they gas or are they electric? The Zeigler and Brown. So I don't know if that's gas or electric. Okay, well, here we have uh, the five thousand. $200 one, but I think it comes with this table and chairs attachment as well. That's all right. Again, no hot plates. Hopefully they have hot plates. What's this one here? Dishwasher? Oh no, gas. Maybe they are gas. Mate, are these gas? Okay, well that barbecue galore visit was really good. It was, I uh, saw the Ziggy and uh, yeah, it was really good. Now it's just the decide. Don't want the smaller one more portable or a bigger one? Well, let's find out. Let's find out. But there's nowhere else is open. Have a look, it's like a desert town. I'm waiting for the tumbleweeds to all start flying around, but the only other shop open is the good guys. So let's go and check out some electronics. Have a look at these computers, 400 bucks, 250, 350. You got the expensive ones here, a thousand dollars. Why on earth would you buy an Apple? I'm never getting an Apple again. They're just a rip-off company. I'm so sick of them. So sick of Apple. I'm getting an HP next time because I think they use HP on um, Harvey Specter. Oh no no no, that was a Dell. Yeah, I'm getting a Dell because Harvey Specter uses a Dell. For an electrical shop, they haven't got the air conditioning on, and this place is like walking through an oven. 
So let's get out of here. Bernice, look. Singapore me go ring, eh? Hey. hey. Alright, we're at Woolworths now. We're just sussing out all the uh, stuff that they're like, all the Christmas stuff they're just trying to clear. Bernice wants me to buy all this stuff. I'm like, Bernice, I'm on a diet. I can't eat all this or I'll get fat. Ooh, I want the wood. Two dollars fifty. No, I don't want it. We got all the Christmas wrapping for seventy-five cents now. That one's all right. Be worth stocking up on that. But what Bernice wanted me to get, and the only thing I'm tempted by, is these mince pies. You know, mince pies. I love these things. They're awesome. It's the only thing I'm tempted by. Two dollars. Or this thing. It's one dollar. One dollar cookies. But they're made in India, so I'm a bit uh, dubious. Well, here we are down the uh, JD today. I got the Esky. You know why. But have a look at these mushrooms. Crikey. Huge. Look at those. Mate, I want to eat one. Do you reckon I could? White underneath, all right, isn't it? I should eat a couple. Look at this paper bark from the paper bark tree. Ugh. Should I eat one? Let me know down below. So Bernice has brought... What is that? What? What is this? Sour plum calamansi. Sour plum calamansi. <laughs> calamansi. Calamansi. Mmm, yum. <coughs> oh shit. And we got some uh, oranges. And some bread that's <laughs> from expired last year. Oh, as in, no, the year before. Yeah. So we're going to feed that to the fish. And what do I got? In my special box. Let's see. Let's see, folks. Let's see. Let's see. It's just like Christmas again, isn't it? Well, I got my favourite stubby holder, the one I found. And I got this thing. And da 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 da. A fine selection of Australian beers. Forex bitter. Yeah, right. I got the Hawthorne Golden Ale and I got the single fin. Yeah, so I'm set for the afternoon with this beautiful sunset. Oh, let's have a look. Okay. Yep, they're beautiful. Okay, so here we go. Hang on, Hang on a second. Let me just turn this around so I can see. Oh yeah, I'm still there. Okay. Let's try the Calamansi. Calamansi. Sour palm. Mmm, smells good. Oh, that tastes like that stuff that you always like. Yeah. The salty yeah. sour plum stuff. Yeah. Looks like a storming over there. I can hear some thunder. Looks well and truly like it's raining. It's spitting here. But it's not too bad, but there's definitely some storm action over there. Oh, mate. G'day. Watch out, dude. There's a huge storm up there. A little lightning. So be careful. Make sure you drink plenty of beers. Stay hydrated. Looks like a little town or something. I like Smurfs. Oh, there, there goes the big stingray. Oh, I just missed it. Damn it. It was big too. <sighs> so I just had this lighter in my pocket and um, it just exploded. You know, it just exploded in my pocket. I was like, whoo! And went pop! Bang! It was like pop! And then I felt this really instant coldness on my leg. But yeah, Bernice told me that it happens quite a bit. But it's never happened to me in my life. So uh, if it's happened to you, let me know down below. Now I have to go steal a new lighter. Damn it. It's raining. Let's come back. Hopefully that'll keep the temperature down at least. I've got this plant here leaks the water into a pot I've got here which I 
put a plant in so it's sucking up beautiful rainwater. I take care of my plants like they're my children. It's pizzas for dinner, both reduced. Yes, saved. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow. And a happy new year. Bye.